Hi, in this video, I want to show you how to add a link to a website into your Schoology course materials. So just like with before, there's two ways to do this. I can click on the add materials button at the top and I can select the add file link external tool. And my item will appear at the bottom of the list by default right here underneath the previous file I uploaded. But in this case, I want to show you how to do it inside the folder so that it, it shows up exactly where you want it to be. So maybe this is a resource that you want to keep hidden in your distance learning folder. Then you would simply open the distance learning folder and you would hover until you see that little green line and you press and you add your link there. But in this case, I've decided the video that I've got, which is a cat video, needs to be up front and center right away. I want it available. So the first thing I have to do though, before I really start to add this file is find the video. Here we go. I went to TED Ed. This is one of the first videos there. Why do cats act so weird? Look at this little face. I thought, yep, I'm gonna share this video because um, I'm sure it's TED Ed, very educational. So I am copying the link. This is the link slash URL. That's what you're looking for. You're gonna either use keyboard commands or your mouse to copy it. Your keyboard command on a Mac is gonna be that command button and the letter C. On a PC, it's gonna be control C or you can use the mouse, right click, and then you just hit copy, control C. So copy, I've got my URL. <clears throat> I'm going back into my Schoology course now. I'm in resources and I'm gonna hover till I find that little dotted green line. I wanna put this as the top video in my resources. So I click the link there and I scroll down. I add file, link, or external tool. I'm gonna press that. Now in a previous video, I showed you ways how to add a file. In this video, I'm going to be adding a link. So I press that middle button for link. It's you can look for that icon, the chain link, um, anywhere within Schoology, and that represents a link to an external website. So here we go, link URL. I've already copied it, so now I just paste. On a Mac, that's the command button and V. On a PC, that's control and V, and I'm saying V as in Victor. So I'm going to right click, and I can also paste that way with my mouse, control V. There's my URL, and now I'm gonna give this a title, cat video because why not? And then down here under options, um, this is a really critical piece here. By default, Schoology wants you to display the link inside Schoology, but we've learned from experience that a lot of websites don't work really well inside Schoology, and sometimes they force you to open it in a new window anyway. So the best practice here is to turn that feature off. This will automatically pop the link up into a new browser tab. So I'm gonna just repeat that really quickly. We paste the link, we give it a title, and then we uncheck this option because we want the, the website to open in its own window. So I'm gonna hit add. And we'll notice with resources expanded that I have a link right here to the cat video. And just to prove it to you, I'm going to click on my link, cat video. There it is, my link is working. So this is another great way that you can add resources is by adding these links to external websites. I hope this information was helpful.